All right, so, like, uh, so Richmond Ayi again. <laughs> I I seriously don't know what to say. But Hamza Isa um, with that first goal for Kraha to focus, sixth goal of the season. Um, then again, he had to go down to goalkeeping error. Coach. Look, um, keepers will make mistakes, okay? But when it comes to Richmond Ayi, the type of mistakes he's making, look, are too elementary, too kindergarten, yeah. unacceptable. For a hearts of a goalkeeper, it is sad. Look, he's obviously not the best keeper in the team. Mm -hmm. I had done some checks, and I don't know the whereabouts of Eric Entry. Eric Entry. Yeah. Some very close friends of mine visited Hassafok when they played Kumasa Sante Kotoko. And I was told from a reliable source that Hassafok has only two goalkeepers, functional mm -hmm. at the moment. That is the overbloated <laughs> Richard Atta and this very shambolic <laughs> Richmond Ai. You ask yourself, a team of the stature of Hearts of Oak should not, never, be going through such problems mm. if the managers of the team are up and doing, and they are indeed modern. I believe Elijah Campy is a cake. I believe So uh, 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 Dote is a cake. I believe that Dr. Nyautamago, with all his experience, is done. Because I don't understand why a player signs a professional contract and one of the responsibility of a player on the payroll of the mm -hmm. team is to maintain his shape. Yeah. You're not I've going got to take copies. Look, yeah. I've got copies of contract that players of House of Oak have signed. And that clause is clearly stated in there. So like I said here last week, I don't understand why Richard attack. Is on the payroll of Hasafo. His stomach is too big. And I repeat myself, he cannot dive, he cannot jump, he cannot kick, he cannot run. So he must, his contract terminated immediately. Go get whatever the problem is with Alawa should be fixed. Yeah. Because Alawa clearly, one time national goalkeeper. Yeah. I mean, when he, when he came in from Lagos Cities, he was starting games. It's, it is clear he was starting that games. That, I mean, he came to take the number one sports room. There is an issue. Yeah. Or there are issues. But if you love Hasafok, and you think Hasafok, and you respect the fact that somebody is investing in this team week in, week out, whatever the issues are when it comes to the goalkeeping department, immediately without delay. Mm. It needs, because look, these things, it will not stop for as long as Richmond I turns around and he sees Richard Atta, fat Richard Atta, yeah. big Richard Atta, big stomach Richard Atta, as the one competing with him, hmm? he will do the sort of things exactly. he's doing. Because how on earth could you just allow this ball yeah. to pass through your legs like that? I would have controlled that ball ah. and passed. <laughs> there was you no mean, punch. You'd have given a cool pass. Ah, no, but anybody at all would control the ball. Look, my, my juvenile players, my goalkeeper, my yeah. juvenile goalkeeper wouldn't even attempt to make. Maybe look at the ball that, that went past. And, and you look at the strike from Richard Dunn. It lacks it, power. It, exactly. It lacks it's not like there's so much so power behind it. It is a control and touch. A goalkeeper would have just started and teased the opponent. 94th minute. Eventually, he had to go around apologizing to the supporters. Eventually, he had to have seen videos of him begging the House of Folk supporters. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look, House of Folk is not run in that manner. House of Folk is not run in that manner. But I don't blame the young man. Who are those doing the recruitment for this team? Mm. It's a big question. Campi, yeah, uh, big question. Uh, 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 Odote. Uh, I, 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 it's been a while since I heard... Opari speak. Is this there with them? Opari speaks. Yeah, Opari, I mean, he has people he speaks with. He's not, he's not, exactly. Yeah. So, you see, if you do things like this, you will get relegated. I have said that if they don't put an end to this sort of performance, 
they are bound for relegation. Mm. And I will be so happy because we were told that nobody can run this thing better. In 14 years, under Toby Afede, mm -hmm. the great king, infrastructure-wise, he's doing something that I have never seen of us of all before. But on the field of play, his regime is the worst when it comes to us of folk on the pitch. Winning lot. This team could win the league with ease. This team could go to Africa and compete. Play an unbeaten run in winning the Champions League mm -hmm. of Africa. What has gone wrong? The same people are there doing the same thing over and over. You expect different results. Look, read my lips and watch this show again. It will get worse and worse and worse. Okay. Because... If they don't change their way of doing things, as for the football, I'm not going to waste time to comment. The, the football is bad. The football is very bad. The coaching has never been up to standard. Mm. You don't see any progression in whatever they are being taught. When you see House of Oak plays today, next week it is worse. The following week, it is hanging in the yeah. air, being slapped by the ordinary air, left, right, center. Mm. Not having a perfect ground to build upon. No foundation. How do you run House of Oak like that? It's sad. It's very, very sad. And for, look, everybody who's a House of Oak supporter, you should never be happy with this. 